<laughs> so this is uh, the entrance to a beautiful place that we put together. A lot of people came together to put this place. From the smallest details in the tile to the, the paints on the wall, everything. Somebody walked in and said, this will look nice. And we made it happen. For the Brandon travel all the way from Dallas, and slept here in the same floor for three days for painting this graphic. Is he the Jehovah's Witness guy? Or? Yeah, he's a Jehovah's wow. Witness. Greetings of peace, brother. He serves humanity, so I so will let him uh, talk a little bit about it. Well, there, there isn't too much to say. Just uh, you know, I work I work at a Moroccan restaurant that's right next to. Do you, are you familiar with Dallas or, or with Irving? No, no. There's a there's a, a masjid in, in Irving called ICI. It's, it's a very very big Islamic center. Okay. I work at a restaurant literally next to it. So before I started working at the restaurant, I knew nothing about Muslims. I knew, I just you know I, I wasn't in, I had no idea who Muslims were, right? Uh -huh. so I started working at this restaurant and. Especially Fridays after Juma, uh -huh. it just gets flooded with, 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 with the Muslim community, right? Uh -huh. So I really got to know the Muslim community and I honestly found love. I've learned so much about generosity, about kindness. Uh, um, you know, they've been so good to me. Um, and I just, I wanted to give something back. Actually, I was talking to Brother Jalil who helped me come down here to, to get this done. Um, there was actually a protest in, in Irving. I don't know if you saw it in the news. It was uh, uh, people protesting against the, the Muslims in the community. And I felt like that was very bad. I felt like not all Muslims, not all non-Muslims feel that way. Some of us very much appreciate your presence in the community. And I just, uh, um, this is what I like to do. Actually, I felt appropriate to give this gift to the Muslim community because it comes from the Islamic era. You know, in the, in the Islamic art, the, the, you cannot portray life. You cannot portray faces. Yeah. You cannot yeah. portray animals, human beings. How so, did you learn about all this? I, 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 I'm around the Muslim community. I spend more time around the Muslim community than I do my own family. So, 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 you know, it's funny because I, when I started working at the Moroccan restaurant, I was already doing a different kind of art form. Okay. Um, then I started seeing the, the you know the, the Moroccan tiles and I felt so inspired. I wanna do that. I wanna do that. So alhamdulillah, I, I looked in books, I looked in the internet, wherever I tried to do my research and study. And alhamdulillah, I learned a little bit, you know, I'm still a student, I'm learning. Yeah. But I got to, to, to contribute this. The reason we felt it appropriate is because in the Andalus Spain, uh -huh. they, uh, they would, in the palaces, in the, in the mosques, uh -huh. this type of uh, this tile. Design. Design. Yeah. Exactly. But what's really cool about in Spain, uh -huh. they don't paint it. They actually hand carve out the tile. Uh -huh. And like, I've seen a video of how they do it. I just lost my mind. I was like, mashallah, that's so much work. All they do is paint it. I mean, that's work too, but these guys yeah. cut it by hand. So I just wanted to get contribute. That, you know, to, to the Muslim so how, how did you learn about this event, about what was going um, on there? Brother Jalil right here, actually, he okay. used, he's a great guy. Okay. I don't care what anybody says about him. <laughs> uh, so he uh, used to be the manager at this Moroccan restaurant where I work at, right? Okay. So he, he helped me get that job and he, he, he taught me how to, how to work at the restaurant and everything. And he's a good friend of mine. So he's very involved. He's the Dallas representative for Islam in Spanish. Okay. And uh, he knows Brother Mujahid very well. Uh -huh. Brother Mujahid is the one, him and, and uh, the other brother and the sisters are the ones helping who, who put this together, right? Yeah. So he told them, I wanted to contribute this, this, because for the same reason, you know, it, it fits well with what's going on, and Definitely. I wanted to give something from my heart. Yeah. So he let them know that I, I wanted to do this, and they they brought me down here from Dallas, and they, you know, how did that happen? Thank you so much. Yeah, we all pleasure. appreciate all pleasure. your efforts, I really. Everybody here, so, you know, Th this is what religion should be about. Right, People yeah. getting along exactly. together exactly. and, and exactly. really. Exactly. Yeah, so, definitely. Uh, I'm sorry, what's your name, sir? Oh, my name is Brandon. Brandon, it's a pleasure to meet you, sir. Agil. Agil. Yes. I was born in Kenya, East Africa, but uh, father's originally from Yemen. Okay, so yeah. it's, it's Arabic. I am Arab, but I don't speak okay. Arabic. My wife here from uh, Abu Dhabi. <laughs> okay. Pleasure meeting you. Is it 25 person they will stay?